The day started out like most, waking up at the ungodly hour of 7.45 in the morning. You know, uh, brushing my teeth and stuff. And changing, bad editing. <laughs> and then finding some weird doppelganger -y cars, one of which was ours. And we weren't really sure which one was ours, so we kind of just picked one and drove away and got lucky. This has been a joke, by the way. And uh, I'll just skip all the really boring parts of the drive because basically it was all just chain restaurants and mini golf places and like dermatologist offices. So that's not very interesting. But as you can see, there's really pretty water and bridge lines. And then my mom says, Thank you, Claire, for dragging us our tissues out here. It's really pretty. And that kind of made me feel like I was doing something right for once. Hooray. And then we finally arrive at destination numero uno and wait in complete agony to park only to find this lovely thing on the back of a car of a complete grown adult. But I soon forgot all about that blunder of humanity because even Twilight couldn't manage to taint such a beautiful view. There's hair in my face walking over a bridge. Here I go, it's a pretty little bridge. And it's windy. And there's hair in my face. After spotting a friendly reminder, we finally reached the very sandy path that led to a very sandy beach. They should have named the island Sandabel. Shoot me. We took a wrong turn and landed on a beach, so... Oops. I was happy to be there and all, but I was kind of hoping that's what would have happened. That we would have taken a wrong turn and ended somewhere beautiful like this. I know it was planned, because it's easier to plan things, but, sorry about the thumb, I feel like we all lost a sense of adventure. Not us as a family, but, you know, us as humanity. It's that we don't take time to be spontaneous. But I quickly forgot about that thought too, because I just had to relish in the fact that there were no people on this beach, and it was beautiful. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I hate people. After proclaiming my hatred for people, it was time for happy, skippy, splashy fun times, shove the hair out of your face times, give up times, turn to the sea and spread your arm times, mother taking in obligatory photo times, and more hair in my face times. Hair. And that's not to exclude question whether I'm a hipster Tumblr post yet time. Good time. Though the morning ended with a bit of sweat as you can see from my horribly shiny face, we still succeeded in having a really good time and we learned a few things. One, that it was really simple to make stupid faces. Two, that my brother has an extremely distracting mustache. Three, it's very easy to annoy our parents. Four, my brother's mustache. Five, spontaneity does not always equal fun. You're allowed to plan things and have fun, and I think I learned that lesson most of all. I hope you guys enjoyed viewing my morning, and I will see you soon. Bye. This is basically what it's going to be like all summer. <laughs>